So just finished a round here at the falls at Barber Creek. 55 or $50 on the weekend, $45 during the week. Hands down, best course yet for the rate. Uh, they do not have an active driving range. They said that they just got approved from the township and their driving range is going right across the street here. I'm giving this course at 8.5. They get that driving range. I, I don't see any course and they say the price that they are, I don't see any course touching it. What is good? It's your boy Chuck and we are back at it like a crack addict. To all my new viewers, smash that subscribe button. I don't beg anybody, but there's many benefits that come to it. You're not going to want to miss this content. Picking right up where we left off in 2022 with the driving range because it was fresh off the presses and brand new. The rates this year, 2023, was $50 on the weekdays and $55 on the weekend. So they went up $5. So let's see what's good. You don't need to go to the clubhouse to hit the driving range. You put your card in there and you can get your bucket of balls in a small, medium, and large if I'm not mistaken. But getting out here. I believe one of my subscribers that I was meeting with to play was out here, but this happened. I know this guy. This is Chuck Brooks, right? Hey, how's it going, Good, man. Good, man. Oh, I thought I recognized hey, him. How you doing, man? I'm good. good you. You <laughs> no, oh, no, I I see your videos on YouTube Do and you uh, really? Facebook. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm Dave. Dave. This was David Ice Kiss. That was pretty crazy, man. David, I'm going to definitely send you some merch. Big shout out meeting you. Same with you, Mark. Love meeting my people like this out here. But getting into the rest of the practice facility, there was a couple different putting ranges, as you can see right here. And I know what you guys really want. You want what everybody gives you up rib. You want views and pictures of this course that you see everywhere but i can't skip past steps so we're gonna give you everything but we gotta put it in reverse terry all right we're skipping steps we gotta start with going into the clubhouse <laughs> so going into the clubhouse here with the homies the staff was very nice but i'm about to show you one of the benefits to being one of my subscribers Read them out, read them out. James O'Shea. James O'Shea. James, let's get it. Nick Maddox. Nick Maddox. All right, Nick Maddox and James. All right, so now we're getting to the meat and potatoes of this. Let's get into it. Guys, do not let this course fool you. Concentrate on holes one through four. You see this waterfall? Don't stop, don't get lulled by it. I guarantee you, you're gonna see it twice and you're gonna be able to drive past it like that. But as you see here, hole number two has a sharp, tight dog leg right. And then hole three is tight as well. Holes one through four concentrate, okay? Hole number four is very tight. Very tight holes. But there was a father and son twosome behind us, so we let them play through. Homies, if you all are in a foursome and you got a twosome right behind you, make somebody's day and let them go past, all right? If there's another twosome behind them, then they just gotta hold that L to the turn. But after you finish up with hole four, it opens up a little bit. As you can see, this is a steep uh, downhill par three. It was a beautiful par three. You see my boy in the bottom right-hand corner, that's where he laid up at. But I like the par threes here a lot. They were nice, gettable. They were tucked in certain spots. And for my homies out here, they do favor the Spartan strong. So if you're a Spartan fan, get to it. But hole eight and nine, if the wind is blowing, these holes are difficult in my opinion, uh, with my experience here. So just play the wind smart. All right, so tell me um, the conditions of the course. What did it look like out there? Was it good? Was it beat up? What was it looking like out there? Pure. The greens are pure. Everything is good. There was a little bit shaggy, but everything has been really good. Too much. What was the difficulty out there on the front nine so far? Um, I think the uh, we got a lot of thick Bermuda grass out, out in the Few different holes and man that stuff is thick yep. so. and it's a little bit tight too uh -huh. um yeah the, yeah the first few holes is pretty but it lulls you man so you got to put some shots out there we're gonna see how this second night goes stay tuned 
All right, so the back nine is a lot more open and gettable. Very short par fours here. The first three are only like 250, 260. Hole number 12 here, as you can see, was only 240 and I had to go for it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, be the one. Oh, that's not the green, yeah. Go in the hole. Threw that thing within six feet. You guys think your boy nailed it? Got his first eagle of the year? You must be crazy. Oh, Chuck. Sick about it. Absolutely sick. Birdie feels like a bogey. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get into the amenities. What's it looking like to you, man? Uh, they looking good? They not looking good? What's... Uh, I don't know, man. That's a, a pretty big wiener right here. Uh, <laughs> if you had a taste for anything other than hot dogs, uh, bring your own food. What you see is what you get, and they did serve alcohol here. There was an event center here, but I don't know if that was for weddings or not. The carts had screens in them, and they not only serve food, but they did have golf logics, which tell slope ratings. Absolutely love that. All right, let's get into this course manicure. I know everybody just shows you the pretty pictures and all that, but we're here to get into this, right? So the tee boxes was good, straight. It was the 4th of July, so they were pretty beat up like this, but we're not being a caring about that. It is what it is, not tripping. The fairways, was a little bit thicker than I'd like. Um, it was the same out here as you see in 2022 and 2023. I don't know if that's just the way the grass grows, um, but it is just a little bit long. Sand traps were beautifully groomed, nicely laid out. No. Oh, Chuck. Can't believe I did that, but the greens were absolutely beautiful. Greens were running very smooth, very good. I can't believe that didn't fall for my boy. <laughs> the homie's fixing divots out here. That's a real one right there. Be like my boy Nick here and always fill in divots, even if they're not yours. But as you can see from 2022 to 2023, the conditions were amazing. I would give the difficulty here a good 5.8. All right. Just remember that play safe on the first few holes. Let's get into that conclusion. Today we're with Hunter. Hunter, how long have you been with the Pulse? I've been here for about three and a half years. Three and, three and a half years, that's awesome, man. Well, I'd like to shake your hand. Thank you, Christian, for taking care of my subscribers. And I did a review on this course last year and it was my highest rated review on a course last year. So what I have for you guys this year is I have this award of excellence. This is, this is definitely, <laughs> was a course worth coming out to. There you go, boss man. Appreciate it. And I thank you all for what you all are doing, man. Keeping other courses honest, putting pressure on them. Of course. All yeah. right. Anytime, enjoy your day. Hey, let's get it. All right, guys. So from 2022 to 2023, there's no difference. This place is still amazing. Had an absolute blast with my people. Fourth of July. We did the thing. Do you see what we just gave them? I don't know what else to tell you but to come out here, man. I, I don't... There isn't a signature hold to me because there's so many, you know, so I didn't even ask that. But today was just beautiful. You see this. I don't know, man. The, the only, only thing that I would say is the fairway grass is just a little bit too high. That's the only critique I would have about this place. But we can't change the ratings. Um, I, I still keep it where it is. I would say it is even more like I did because they put in the driving range. It's even higher. But like david portnor son one bite everybody knows the rules one vote oh, everybody knows the rules right i guess that's what we're gonna say but but guys the falls at barber creek i i just i would drive this every day and i live an hour 10 minutes away man you guys come out here they're not paying me to say this i pay my own way as you always see this place is just absolutely beautiful chuck with tgv we out here man i don't know what else to say man Got another trophy for 2023 here. I know you wanna have one of these sitting by your counter so people can know the recognition. Um, but if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I don't know what you're doing with your life. Your credit score must be a 320 
because it doesn't make sense. We got a lot more free golf coming for you guys. So you might as well do what it do. Smash that subscribe button, man, and get in on some of this free golf. And we're not golfing it in no $2 courses, as you can see. But for everybody else, man, thank you for riding with me. Um, thanks for filming on this 4th of July. You came through and nobody else did. Appreciate you, man. Stay smooth, stay safe, stay tuned. We out here, man. We're not going nowhere. I want you guys to tell me what you guys think about here. Would you play here again? I need to play here again. <laughs> I need my redemption. <laughs> and uh, yeah, definitely need to play here as, many, but, as much as you can. But the course. Awesome. Beautiful course, right? Beautiful but course. For the price, I don't know how they do it, but hey, they're putting pressure on you other courses. And that's what I'm out here for. Right. What was you guys' experience playing with us? It was awesome. Oh, it was so much fun. It was one of the best times I've ever had golf. And, yeah. and I came into this extremely nervous. I told you that from the jump. And honestly, you made it so easy, you know what I mean? Being friendly as you are and just making it feel like we are family, you know what I mean? Appreciate and, and that's, oh, yeah. that's, you know, that's a big key. That's, that's uh, what it's all about. We need to get more people out here doing this because, like, like it, it, you know what I mean? America, this is what it's about. Right? Yeah, 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 you know big facts. I mean? Yep, big facts. Yeah.